Hello, uh, welcome to SC13. Uh, my name is Gord Sissons. I'm a product marketing manager for IBM, representing a product called IBM Platform Symphony. And I've got a real interesting demonstration for you here today. Uh, what I'd like to show you is some work we've been doing in big data analytics. And specifically, we call this the big data challenge. So what we've got on the screen on the left side, we have an open source Hadoop MapReduce cluster. On the right side, we have open source Hadoop as well, but it's actually packaged in IBM's offering called IBM InfoSphere Big Insights. And what I'd like to show you is some of the advantages of using the IBM implementation of Hadoop MapReduce as opposed to open source. And this is actually powered by a technology called IBM Platform Computing. So while I explain, let me just kick off two different Hadoop MapReduce jobs here. Again, on the left, what we're looking at is uh, open source Hadoop 1.1.1. Uh, on the right-hand side, I've just kicked off an identical uh, workload, actually, and an identical um, hardware infrastructure, except this second environment is powered by IBM Platform Symphony. Again, this is a grid management technology that can sit underneath Hadoop. It doesn't matter whether it's open source Hadoop or IBM's implementation of Hadoop. In either case, we can accelerate workloads. So just uh, those familiar with Hadoop MapReduce will recognize what you're seeing on the screen on the left-hand side. You're seeing the Hadoop MapReduce jobs progress. On the right-hand side, what you're seeing is exactly the same uh, jobs progressing, except if you look up at the top of the screen, you'll notice that each time a job completes, the square is turning green. So what you're seeing here is roughly about a six to seven times performance improvement in the actual Hadoop MapReduce job uh, run times. So uh, not to say that every job is going to run six to seven times faster, uh, but you know, on average, we get these kinds of accelerations. We recently actually had a third party audit um, of Facebook workload that Facebook had contributed to the uh, public domain. And what we were able to show in an audited report is on average using Facebook's workload of, of, of four times performance improvement on average. So the advantages are quite compelling. You know, more performance on exactly the same hardware or potentially using less hardware to get the same throughput. So uh, the, the job on the left here is almost done. And what I'm going to do to illustrate another important capability is actually start a second uh, time critical job on both clusters. Um, so now we see that our first job is just completed. Uh, my IBM platform computing cluster is running the demo much more quickly. I'll start a second job, and this job is time critical. We'll call this application B. And what we're finding is that many Hadoop MapReduce applications are time critical, particularly in areas like finance, financial services, uh, telco, um, intelligence. And what tends to happen with Hadoop, uh, open source Hadoop, is when the cluster is occupied running a job, it can only process that job. It needs to wait till the first job is finished to be able to start a second job. One of the advantages of running on the um, IBM Platform Symphony uh, technology is that it can uh, rapidly preempt a long-running job to, to run a time-critical job. So that's what we're seeing here. Even as our first job is continuing to run, the second job has been able to start up immediately. So again, very important for any uh, market where there's um, you know, any sort of time-critical workload. The third and final uh, benefit I'll talk to about using this uh, platform symphony technology for a grid is that it's multi-tenant. And in the open source community, of course, people are just starting to talk about multi-tenancy today with uh, Hadoop MapReduce workloads. This is a mature uh, technology in Platform Symphony, so customers can deploy their Hadoop MapReduce workloads. They can run their other HPC workloads, uh, like batch workloads, for example, MPI workloads. They could even run multiple instances or different versions of Hadoop on the same cluster using our multi-tenant capabilities in, in Platform Symphony. So uh, just to summarize, uh, three, three major benefits. Uh, you've kind of seen them here in the demonstration. First off, the jobs run much more quickly, and this is because of the low latency scheduling architecture at the heart of Platform Symphony. Whether you're running IBM's Hadoop implementation or open source or third party Hadoop implementations, we can accelerate them, helping you get more out of the hardware investment. Second value proposition is around agility. So what I mean by agility is we can react quickly to a time critical workload, uh, get a job on, on and off the grid fast. So again, very important for any application area that's time critical. And the third advantage is today we can run multiple different workloads on the same infrastructure at the same time. So this avoids organizations needing to provision separate uh, cluster environments. They can be expensive and underutilized and kind of you know, run all these different workloads on the same cluster to help reduce cost. So thank you very much. I hope you've enjoyed this quick demonstration.